numericals on mono stable multi vibrator using triple phi timer ic before we begin to solve the numericals we need to understand the design equations for the mono stable multi vibrator the mono stable multi vibrator the output pulse width is given by t is equal to w which is equal to 1.1 ra into c this ra is present because it is the resistance responsible for charging the capacitor and in the design we will be assuming the capacitor value c to be 1 microfarad one of the major observations that we need to make here is that we are applying a negative trigger pulse which is shown by the waveform and this negative trigger pulse is applied at pin number 2 and the output waveform is obtained at pin number 3 so the first numerical is to design a mono stable multi vibrator using triple phi timer to obtain a pulse width of 10 millisecond when they say pulse width of 10 millisecond that means it is w or t which is to be calculated and we know from the design that we have to assume the value of capacitor c to be equal to 1 microfarad so substituting we obtain ra into c to be equal to 9.09 millisecond and ra to be equal to 9.9 kilo ohms whenever a design question is asked what is important is to note that we need to draw the schematic of the mono stable multi vibrator and mark the appropriate values of r a and the capacitance c so let us solve the second numerical so in this a mono stable multi vibrator circuit is mentioned with resistance r a and the output pulse t p is mentioned we need to calculate the value of capacitance the difference between the previous problem and this problem is that the pulse width was represented as t whereas here it is represented as tp it is just the difference in the representation of the variable but the equations remain the same so if you substitute the value of the resistance and the value of the pulse width you get the value of the capacitance which is close to 1 microfarad same as that of the standard value so these are the simple problems that will be provided in the mono stable multi vibrator main observation that you need to note is that whenever a design question is asked the schematic needs to be drawn thank you for watching